hi everyone in this video i'm going to teach you how to bake everything without an oven so i'm going to teach you three different ways you can bake without an oven you don't need an oven to bake anything yes the oven plays a big part but if you don't have an oven you can still bake and there are three different ways you can do that you can see how i baked my bread and my pound cake without any oven and it came out so well you guys are going to love this recipe let's get started for method one we are going to bake our bread so i have my proofed bread here and i'm just going to transfer this into my baking pan and then we're going to bake this i'm going to drop the recipe for the bread and the pound cake so don't worry okay so for method one we're going to be using the sand method okay this is an ancient way of baking where you use sand to bake okay so what we do is we're going to transfer our sand into our saucepan and try and get a very big saucepan okay because it's going to house that oven then i'm going to cook the sand till it becomes hot and that's the preheating okay so you are going to preheat this for 30 minutes so it becomes very hot and when it becomes hot the color changes it becomes dry and that's when you know it's ready for your recipe okay so we're just going to spread it out and then we're going to put that baking pan inside it's okay so you're going to cover this and then bake the bread note that if your sand and saucepan is not preheated this will be very difficult to bake so it's very important to preheat it first now you cover this with a foil or a napkin so that it can trap the heat in it and then you put this on any source of heat it can be your gas stove your hot plate or anything at all that can be regulated okay so as far as it's giving you heat you are good to go now make sure you regulate it otherwise it can burn okay we're going to continue baking this to every part of the bread bakes properly and there you have it your no oven bread and this bread was so good you guys will love it it baked for 45 minutes to an hour and we're good to go now we're going to just check it and see if the inside part is cooked and you can see every part is cooked it looks perfect like it was so good and it was so fresh you guys will love this the inner part was baked as well and we're good to go you can use the same method to bake any other thing especially hard pastries okay like bread or any kind of hard pastry okay or you can use it to bake any other thing now for method two we're going to be baking this pound cake and we're going to be using the salt method of baking this is the same as a sand method just that we're going to be using salt instead of sand the only difference is that this may be a little bit costly so the sand is normally better but if the sand is a little bit inconvenient for you because going out to carry sand and all that may be inconvenient for some people so you use salt this goes through the same process as the sun so you preheat the salt it changes color then you put your baking pan or whatever it is you want to bake in it cover with a foil or a napkin and then bake it on your gas stove or your hot place okay regulate the fire so that it doesn't burn and you have your baked vanilla pound cake ready you can use this to bake any kind of soft pastry or hard pastry and it's going to work so well this came out so well and it's something i baked without an oven so you don't have an excuse anymore to bake you can bake without an oven for method three i didn't bake anything but i'm going to teach you how to set it up and this is the water method so you are going to transfer some water into your saucepan and they are going to a rack in it or anything that can lift it up a bit okay then you put your baking pan or whatever it is you want to bake in it cover this and then bake it's advisable to also preheat the water if you can before you start baking let me know which method you'll be trying see you in my next video bye